What's up everybody, Matt Austin here, and today, oh hell yeah, and we're doing another town hall. It's a town hall, yeah, I should have been my town, yeah. Oh hell yeah, uh, this episode number five. Yay! And, uh, yeah, this, we got a lot of good stuff this time, guys. Uh, stuff I never thought I'd see in my town, because we got a bunch of bullshit, but, uh, I actually found some pretty cool stuff. Uh, I think we'll start with Walmart. Woo! Got a ton of stuff from Walmart. Uh, here's one of the biggest fails I've ever done on this channel. Was, uh, I, I was doing a whole video kind of mystery stuff. I was going to put it out before the town hall. It's like these little NECA balls that had, like, Halloween and Chucky stuff in it. Oh, hey! And then uh, these little mystery packs I found in Books A Million. They had, like, mystery little figures in it. Oh, hey! And, uh... I did the whole video, got excited to put it out, and realized I didn't press record. You suck. So I opened all this stuff, all this mystery stuff, and didn't even have it recorded, so <laughs> huge fail. It was horrible. But yeah, we got some cool stuff in there, and it's back there. And I'll put up a little video, show y'all. Got a little Shaun the Dead uh, figure, Lori Strode. Yeah! Uh, I'll keep Shaun the Dead back there. And uh, the Halloween stuff was pretty cool. Got enamel pins. Uh, magnets, some little NECA heads, all kinds of stuff, shoelaces, and then uh, in the Chucky one, you know, we got kind of the same stuff, uh, only thing different, we only got one NECA head, but anyways, I'm blabbing, let's go to Walmart, let's have a damn good time, oh hell yeah, first off, we gotta start with the most important purchase I made these last two weeks, and uh, I can't believe I found it. It is this badass Jason mask. What is oh that? my god! <laughs> Ninety-eight cents. The you know I'm I'm doing the opposite of everybody else. I'm trying to find the crappiest mask I can find. You're stupid. We found the Michael Myers one. Now we got the crappiest Jason mask. Ninety-eight cents. And you know it. You know how it goes. I gotta try it on. Oh hell yeah! Do it. There we go. Oh my god. What a beauty it is. Man, I, I can actually breathe in this one, so it ain't too bad. No shit. Uh, I ain't gonna keep this on. I just thought I'd try it on. But uh, as far as breathability, it's alright. But the rest, crap. Total crap. I do got a good Jason mask coming. We'll check that out. Anyways, let's get this crap off. Five hours later. There we go. Uh, uh, next up, after the Jason mask. I almost ordered this offline. Glad I waited. It's coming in at, I believe, fourteen eighty-eight. Oh hell yeah! It's the Creeper no, Jeepers Creepers uh, Mego figure. The cloth ones. Uh, already got Leatherface and Hannibal, Candyman. Now I got the Creeper. And there are a few more that I do want, but man, you had to get the Creeper. And I did almost order this, so that's cool. I found it. Great condition. And I made, I don't know how many trips to Walmart, and each time found something I like. So, there we go. That was one trip. Jason Mask and the Creeper. Next up. You know, I was going to wait to get these. Because I just kind of wanted, like, one figure from each franchise until I had, like, all the ones I wanted. And then I was going to start getting the rest of them. But I realized after a while that would be hard to do. Because they'll be going up in price if I wait too long. So here we go. Mint condition. Friday the 13th. The new blood. Oh my god. Jason Neca, Neca figure. And uh, man. This is the one. And he's got the little bush cutter. Uh, he's got some badass stuff. He's got the ugly ass face. What the fuck is that? Man, this is just cool. Machete. Knife. He's got that little... Uh, it's like Star of the Show, a little spiky went around killing with. Ah, He's got a little, got uh, another bush cutter, half mask. Just badass stuff. As a former, uh, lawn care specialist, seeing that Great bush job. cutter, man, if I ever make a figure of myself, there we go. I'll have a bush cutter to go with it. Badass, not a scuff on it. They had one that's kind of messed up. I looked around, found this one, I was like, oh, hell yeah, we're getting it. We're breaking the bank. Badass. Uh... 
Only other accessory I would think to have with it would be a uh, sleeping bag. <laughs> Bash that girl Jesus against the tree with a sleeping bag. But besides that, badass. Love it. One of my new favorite figures. Wow. I'll, I might be saying that a few times in this video. I'm just warning you. But there we go. Let's keep Walmart going. We got more stuff. And, uh, you know, I've been saying for a while now, I'm going to start collecting these. I finally pulled the trigger, got my first one, because I see it every time I go there, so why not? Toonie Terrors. We got Ash. I do got some Evil Dead stuff back there, but I do not have a figure, and I will be getting that NECA figure, the Evil Dead 2 figure. But now, uh, there we go. Toonie Terrors. When I went to Target, I found a ton of Toonie Terrors, and... I'm going to stock up next time I go, but had to get Ash first. Had to get my boy. So there we go. And oh my God. These next two. When I've seen them and I've seen the condition, how perfect it was. Oh my God. And I might say this wrong. McCready, McCready, the thing figure. My boy, Kurt Russell. Badass movie, badass character. I mean, this figure is... Whew. You talk about minty, minty fresh. Look at that. And I think there was another, another one of these that came out. This is the survival version. Oh my God! Would you look at that? Would you just look at it? That's freaking badass. And uh, I had to get it. Yep. And I had to get one more because I saw this, and apparently it just been stocked that day because I was there the day before. I didn't see it. I looked everywhere. Not for this. I didn't even know it was out yet. Actually. You suck. But, oh my God! You want to talk about packaging? An American werewolf in London. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at that hologram. I don't know if y'all can see it. I, like I said, I can't always get the lighting right. But oh my God! It's the Ultimate Nightmare Demon set, which was like 30 seconds of the movie, but they actually made a whole naked thing out of it. So that's pretty damn cool. It's got four interchangeable heads from all the Nightmare Demons. Uh, I looked at it, I don't think they're werewolves. Uh, a lot of people were saying that. I think they're demons or mutants, but I don't think they're werewolves. Nazi mutant demon werewolf. What the fuck? The man is badass. He's got a torch. <laughs> he got their machine guns. <laughs> These things were evil. I hated the noise they made. I hated it. Yeah, uh, it scared me it. when I was a little kid. Probably still does. I need to go check it out. But oh my god, this is badass. Perfect condition. All the figures I got from Walmart, I, I go to this, well, I go to all the Walmarts and look. The other ones, they treat their figures like crap. There's one in town, I'll give it a shout out. Albert Pike Walmart, Hot Springs, Arkansas. It's, it's kind of where all the trashiest people in town go. But good lord, they take care of their figures when they stock them. And I think it's because there's some fellow collectors. It's probably why I'll never get a chase there, because there's fellow collectors. But anyways, there we go, badass stuff. Yeah. I'm just happy with everything I got from there. Uh, next up, we'll do a quick one real quick. I don't know how much battery I got left on my thing. Hopefully it don't die. And hopefully it's not doing that zooming thing. I think I fixed it. We'll find out. Books a million. Woo! Oh my god. I didn't go crazy there. It's kind of last, last stop uh, the other day. But it gets something kind of cool. That's where I got those mystery minis I told y'all about. Oh but, hey! Uh, yeah, coming in at 539. I had to add to my little Funko Keychain collection. Hannibal Lecter. Oh my milk. god, look at that. He's got the bloody mouth. Looks just like him. That's definitely going up there. Probably right under his figure up there. So there we go. Just a little quick purchase. I, I, there is some stuff I'm going to be going back to get. But when Walmart's killing it like they did this last couple weeks, you can't beat that. And another quick one, just because I already put the video out. Woo! <clears throat> but of course, the variant Nude Cybot figure. I gotta throw that in there. $24.99. Go watch the video. It's a couple videos back. I can't believe I got it. And I do have a new enemy because of it. So. I made you my bitch! If you don't know about that, go check it out. Next up, it's the one I did yesterday. Uh, if you watched it, my Target figure, uh, figure hunt. Well, this will be coming out Friday, so I guess it was Wednesday. Anyways, y'all probably already know what I picked up. I couldn't, I couldn't turn it down. I've been debating getting it off uh, line for a while. I finally got it in the wild. Woo! There's a bunch of them, but I got the best one, of course. Not a scratch on it. There we go. Trick or treat. 
<laughs> Sam Necker figure. Oh my god. Packaging is like way more beautiful than it is in the pictures. It's got like a shine to it. Almost like a hologram thing, but not really. Metallic look is what I'd say. Look at this. Hopefully y'all can see it. Like if, if if I go back and it's not like where y'all can see it, I'll put like a little video up, but there we go. He's got the interchangeable heads. He's got the lolly, he's got the bag, he's got the flaming pumpkin. He's ugly some bitch under that hood, but he's cute otherwise. Look at that. Just in time for Halloween. Trick or treat. One of my favorite definitely one of my favorite modern movies, but maybe just one of them all time. I love it. Uh wish they'd make a sequel. If they got something good out of it, they got Sam or icon off one movie. That's how you do it right there. It's badass. Love it. Thank you, Target, for finally giving me that. <clears throat> and uh, now I'm going through. I don't have as much stuff. I think I just spent a lot of damn money is what I did. But uh, next up, FYE. Woo! Oh, hell yeah. And uh, I ain't going to make the mistake I did last time. We're going to start with the small stuff, end with the big stuff. That's what she said. But uh, yeah, I started collecting these. The girl talked me in an uh, uh, extra one this week. She said if I get two, I get one for like 70% off. So Yay! We got magnets. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I'll go through them real quick. We got Beetlejuice. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. I'm going to get like a whole like metal sheet to put these on. Because I'm a genius. We got Beetlejuice. From the music side, we got the Misfits go. uh, logo. Does he have a name? Uh, it just says Misfits Skull, so there we go. Love the Misfits. Danzig, what up, brother? And last but not least, The Exorcist. Woo! Gotta get more Exorcist stuff. Oh, hell yeah. But I got a magnet, so that's a good start. And there we go. Got some cool magnets from FYE. Uh, they're $3.99, $4.99 each. I'll get y'all the real price, but... Uh, this was two separate trips to FYE. I'll, I'll give you the first one first. <clears throat> Guys, I finally got them. I've been trying for a while, find them in the wild, finally did. We got Michael Myers knuckle figure. Oh my god. Look at that. This thing's beautiful. Uh, from Halloween 2. Y'all let me know, why is there no like official Halloween like first movie stuff? Or is there? I never see it. He's got a hammer, he's got a, a syringe needle. Looks like a scalpel. It's the one where he's in the hospital. Oh my god, he's got the bloody eyes. Why won't you die? Neck of clothes figure. Badass. I love these. Uh, that's going to look great in my collection. Uh, get a good view of the wall now. It's going to look a lot different probably next video. I'm about to do some rearranging and uh, just oh, get it no. right. But oh hell yeah, I can't wait to get this one up there. Five minutes later. Oh my god. As a kid, I didn't like it. It wasn't one of my favorite Nightmare on Elm Streets, but it definitely grew on me. Now it's uh, it's up there with my favorite, probably top three, I'd say. Wes Craven's New Nightmare, Freddy, Naked Clothes figure. Oh my God! I saw this, I was like, yep, it's it's coming home with me. He's got that crazy claw he had in the movie. Uh, he's got the demon head. I mean, he just looks plain evil, man. Just how you like your Freddy? I like my Freddy evil. I like evil, <laughs> not evil. Uh, but yeah, this is pretty damn cool. Uh, now, the box art uh, back there shows them with like the little shredded up stuffed uh, T-Rex. I don't see that in here, but uh, that'd be cool if it's back there somewhere. I'll never know. It ain't getting open. But there we go. Oh my god. Already some of my favorite stuff ever. And I still got a little bit more to go. Oh yeah! Here we go. Mint condition. My NECA collection is just skyrocketing. Yeah. Nothing in value, but just in what we got. Halloween 2. Michael oh, Myers. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, look yeah. at that. Just look at it. I mean, this thing is beautiful. This thing is perfect. Uh, man. It's got a few interchangeable heads. Uh, it's got kind of the same stuff the cloth, cloth one had. It's got like a little jack lantern that apparently turns and like has a skull inside. Oh my god. This thing's cool as hell. I saw it. I saw the condition. I was like, yep, getting it <laughs> for sure. 
And last but not least, from FYE. Oh wait, no, I do got one more thing. Let me uh let me get that real quick. That's a discount on that. $8.49 with the discount. I forgot I got that. Went back and got that because I had a coupon. But uh I had to get Rob Zombies Halloween, Collector's Edition, Still Book. Yeah, it's only eight bucks. I've never seen the making of like four and a half hour documentary. Love this version, just like I love the original. I can always separate them, and I do like it. Now, Halloween 2 by Rob Zombie. And last but not least, you know I had to get a Funko Pop. But this time, I went above and beyond. I got about the coolest Funko Pop you could ever get. It's the... Ghostbusters banquet room. Jesus! Oh my God! A little setting. It's like thirty bucks or something. Uh, I'll put up the price, but there we go. You got Peter Bankman. You got Slimer. You got Egon. Oh my God! This thing is badass. I love it. Kind of thought about doing like an unboxing video, and I was like, Nah, I'm keeping it in the box. It's been on card. This thing's too cool. Definitely going back there. And uh, yeah, I love it. This thing's so cool. As far as Funko Pops go, I will take that all damn day. Oh, hell yeah. There we go. That's FYE. Got a lot of badass stuff this haul. Uh, some of my best stuff ever. Favorite stuff, I'll say. There we go. That's everything that I know of, unless something, I don't know, scurried away somewhere. <laughs> you never know. But, uh, yeah, badass stuff. Uh, love everything I got. And, uh, yeah, from now on, I think... Town hall videos are going to be a lot shorter. Well, not shorter, but I'm going to put them at the tail end of like, if I do a toy hunt in town, find something cool, I'll just do it right then, that day. I don't want to wait two weeks. Let it pile up. Let it sit. I want it back there. I want to enjoy it. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to get it. I'm going to show it off. And I'm going to put it out to you guys. So, there we go. And a lot quicker return. But, yeah, for town hall number five, a big town hall. A badass haul. Oh, hell yeah. There we go. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah, I just appreciate... I <clears throat> can't talk. Appreciate all the love uh, that you guys give me. Uh, all my regulars that comment down there. The new people that check out the channel. Uh, yeah, let's have a damn good time. Love collecting. Love that I'm back into it. Hope you guys are enjoying it, too. Paz Rescue. Woo! What's up, brother? Uh, he's been on the channel for, damn, coming up on three years, I imagine. Uh, in November, so there we go. Put in request back in the day. Oh, hell yeah, I appreciate it, Paz. Lee Murray, how's Whoa! it going? Katie, how you doing? Hope y'all enjoying the new content. I'll try to get some reactions out every once in a while. Just switch it up. Uh, Cajun Toy Review, Whoa! thanks for checking out the channel. And of course, the figure trap. Whoa! What's up, guys? I uh, appreciate all love. Go uh, subscribe to the figure trap. Go su uh, subscribe to Cajun Toy Review. I'll try to leave a link, or they'll comment, you can follow them from there, but oh hell yeah, good content they're putting out, and uh, yeah, it's just a good time, we're having fun, and that's what it's all about. But anyways, thanks for stopping by, and I'll catch you guys down the road. And that's the bottom line, because Matt Austin said soap.